Welcome to the video. You're seeing it right. You're seeing it right. I wanted to introduce y'all to Oliver. And I need to give you a perspective of how big he is. And I don't know how to right now. But we have had him since January the 18th. And I haven't really mentioned it because we didn't know he was going to make it. So at some point I'll tell y'all the story. And I don't know why how we ended up with a puppy because I've never even had a puppy. Right, Oliver? We don't know what kind he is. He's just a, he's a mess. He's a total mess. We're outside. Uh, he's got him a stick. And yeah, he loves to bite. I'm trying to get him to not do that, but He's getting a little tired. He normally runs and runs. He's a handful, as y'all can imagine. My friend said, he's a pistol. I'm like, you said it. I've never had a little male dog, and I've never had a puppy. But I'll tell y'all the story. It was something about a Facebook, and my bestie was on there on the local Facebook, and the lady said she had a litter dropped off. She lives in the country. You don't know how much to believe, but it doesn't matter. Um, six, five girls, and he's the only boy. He's got a banana peel I had been throwing out. You can't have that. You can't have that, buddy. No, you can't have that. But he is just, <laughs> he is a pistol. And um, he's got short little legs, but so did Olivia. Come here. So he's nine weeks old, maybe 10 on Monday. He weighs about eight pounds now, but when we got him, he weighed 2.7 pounds, full of worms, full of worms. We immediately got an appointment with Dr. Russell, right? You know, we got him on a Monday night. By Wednesday, we were in there with Dr. Russell and she said, <laughs> Here we go. He's got, he got you a stick. He just makes me laugh. So he's kept us busy too. And another reason I haven't been able to make as many videos because I got a handful here. He was a whistle breeches. Little boy. He loves to be outside. We don't know what he is, but I think he could be Border Collie Mix. The reason we were looking at the puppies in the first place is one of the girls was brown and white. And uh, we still have a mess from this storm. There's the snow water. There's a pile of firewood. There's bottles from the bottle dump. I'm going to clean them up at some point. I just... Um... Still have a destruction over here. You know, we're waiting for the guy to come. I can't do it. Uh, last time we had a snowstorm, I tried to get a big branch out of the tree and it hit me on the head and gave me a knot. And I didn't tell y'all about that either. One thing I didn't count on during it was, I don't want him back here, was um, getting to the firewood. These trees around here dropped. It was dangerous, you know dropped all their branches on the firewood pile. Look at that. So anyway, where is he? He is just, he is really, really cute. Uh, he's Biffy. He's, we call him Biffy. <laughs> anyway, there's Olivia's place. Come on, Oliver. He needs to go in in a minute and get him some... Well, he's got water out here, but I mean... So, I guess I'll just go ahead and tell you that we were looking. Well, my bestie was looking, and she said, I know I shouldn't be looking. You said you didn't want another dog. But, um... Oliver, come here. He's going in the nest just a minute. Get out of there. Get out of there. 
And so one of the girls was a brown and white border collie looking. Well, she had been taken. He was the last one left. So he was cute. <laughs> there he goes. He's zooming around now. Come here, Oliver. Don't go under there. He, no, no, he's determined to play in there. So I'm gonna have to put him in. No. Anyway, there he was. So we asked the lady if he was available and she said yes. Now he's going bananas. He's being naughty because I've been able to keep him away from that. But he knows I'm preoccupied. So that's what we got. We, uh, you know, he had problems with his food because he was taken away from his mom at about three weeks, according to the lady. She was like, and I hope he goes to the bathroom. She was like, you know, I've had him for a week and that was when he was about four weeks old. So, you know, we have him on special food. We just had to go back in again because he got diarrhea when we tried to put him, get him on solid puppy food. He just can't. And Dr. Russell wasn't there, but Dr. Stout said it's okay. He can do the science diet, uh, digestive care, half and half puppy. And it's, it's special puppy too. It's the Hills science diet, small bites puppy. And uh, Dr. Stout's like, he's got little legs. I said, yeah. He does. Anyway, there he is. He's at eight pounds now. And he said, I'm not worried about the puppy at all. He is seems to be in really good health. But he gave us some medicine to get him over this last bout of, you know, where his digestive system wasn't handling, where we tried to get him just on puppy food. Anyway, I'll be talking about him, so now you see who he is. See y'all later.